Welcome to the art project. I'm going to do a charcoal portrait of one of my students. Uh, if you are new here, please hit the subscribe button. If you want to get notifications every time I post a new video, hit the little bell button. Uh, if you have already subscribed, thank you so much for coming back. And uh, if you enjoy this video, please hit the like button. Uh, I'm doing a portrait of one of my students in charcoal. And um, I'm really more interested in just doing faces than I am actually trying to do a portrait that really, really, really looks like him. But I am trying to make it look uh, as much like him as possible. Uh, I made a lot of mistakes throughout the entire picture, but I try to come back and correct them a lot. I'm using charcoal, and so I can get a lot of like sweeping shadows and... Um, fill in a lot of area uh, all at one time and I don't have to do a lot of you know pencil shading uh, and get it all in one fell swoop uh, with a piece of charcoal but I continue to come back and work with it more and more now I'm using a piece of charcoal but I honestly can't tell you where I got this piece from but the more I used it the more I really liked it it's really kind of a solid piece of charcoal it's not very soft uh, in other words, it, it doesn't color really, really dark, and it doesn't waste away in your fingers really, really fast. Uh, I've actually used this piece of charcoal twice now on two different um, portraits, and it has really kind of lasted a, a long time. Um, I'm going to find out what kind it is so that I can order some more of it. Um, when I first started the video, I just kind of laid it out, uh, you know, drew the basic oval face then came back and divided it down the middle for the nose and uh, across for the eyes and the bottom of the nose and the mouth and stuff like that so it's kind of laid out according to facial proportions uh, I looked at the photograph a lot to, to decide on those proportions uh, I still got a lot of the proportions wrong and I really got the eyes wrong a lot when I was working on this and uh, early on in the picture it's not it's just not great uh, I think by the time I was done I got something I was pretty proud of even though it doesn't look a hundred percent like the model um, it took me about let's see about an hour and a half maybe two hours to do the whole thing but uh, was working on it uh, during lunch and um, during one of my classes when I had students working on their stuff so I didn't work on it you know all the way through from beginning to end without interruption um, and I just kind of kept building up the darks and the lights and so on just like you would you know kind of on a normal um, on a normal picture if you don't know a whole lot about charcoal drawings or about drawing in general uh, there are a lot of good uh, videos out there um, Proco is a really good uh, YouTube channel you got to check out and um, that, that's that's just one of them but anyway I had a lot of fun doing it and like I said it was practice and so I'm trying to get better and better if you look at that right eye it looks like he's just punched in the eye or something it's all swollen and stuff but uh, I think by the time I got done with the portrait I had fixed that at least a little bit and uh, made it look a little bit more like the model uh, so look at the eye real close and then look how I come back in and I lowered the eyes a little bit darkened in some of the shadow um, I, I did a few things believe it or not you can correct this uh, charcoal pretty easily and so I, I, I just uh, kind of did the best I could for now uh, like I said it's practice so I'm gonna just rather than focus on making this one perfect I'm gonna start another one uh, tomorrow so anyway I wanted y'all to see me working and the process involved in it and uh, let me know what you think down in the comments below uh, do the eyes look as bad as I thought they looked uh, do you think it looks like the photograph um, what do you think about the the overall picture uh, tell me what you think in the comments down below and as always um, please hit subscribe please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching the video and uh, I'm going to show some close-ups here of the different parts of the picture
I really like the nose, probably best of all.